Well, hundreds came together this morning with one mission in mind, fight ALS. The Walk to Defeat ALS is an annual event to raise money for research. CBS Denver, CBS4 that is, is a proud sponsor of the event, and Karen Lee was MC. Our Michael Abeda was at Sloan's Lake, where the walk took place this morning, bringing teams of families and friends together as one. Well, Saturday morning, it was beautiful and a great time to get out and get your exercise, especially if you're doing it to raise money for a great cause. With a snip of some scissors, they were off. Teams starting their lap around Sloan's Lake Park. It feels great. It's the, just the support and the cause and the people out here. It's, it's like family. It's been great. But this isn't a race. No matter what their shirts say, they're all on one team today. Team Defeat ALS. I'm out here today to support some friends, family, co-workers who uh, well, we lost to ALS. Barry Hay has been doing this walk for eight years, ever since he lost someone very dear to him to ALS. I watched my best friend go through it. We watched our co-workers go through it. It's devastating to the family, to everybody. This year alone, his team, the Larvinators, raised $27,000, and they aren't alone. All these teams came together to raise almost $300,000 for ALS research. It's money that's badly needed. We have to find a cure for it. It's so horrible for somebody to go through. So until researchers can find the cure for ALS, Barry and everyone else here will continue to raise money and walk this walk, their loved ones ever on their minds. My best friend Larry Larvick, Russ Richfield with Southern Glazers, um, and anybody else who's had to live through all of this disease. Well, if you missed this event, don't worry. They're planning another walk for Colorado Springs, or you can head to cbsdenver.com. There we'll post a link so you can make a donation to the ALS Association. In Denver, Michael Aveta, covering Colorado First.